What was the first acting gig you got? Mad Men. That was the first gig you got. Mm -hmm. That's the big show for your first gig. I remember going on to set and like, you know, kind of, I had no idea that, because my, my acting school was not like for camera. There was no, it was like more theater type, uh, just learning how to actually act and the craft of acting. And they, and I remember like, you know, kind of doing it and then coming back and there's like all this tape on the floor. And I'm like, like, what, like, what, why, why is, why is there tape why is the tape on the floor? <laughs> and they were like, those are your marks. And I was like, oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Meisner yeah. didn't teach me about marks. No, no, they didn't. No. Same too, where it was like, uh, you know, we were drinking or something and they were like, oh, you need, you drank on this line. And I was like, oh yeah, but like, oh. and they were like, you need to every time in the same, and I'm like, I have to do every time on the same line. Cause I was so just like, I'm real and I'm in the moment. Like there's no. It it's a lot. It's it's harder than it looks. It's like you have to do all these things. Script supervisor keeps coming at you and go, yes, you drank at this line. Hey, you walked over here when he said or like this. Your hand was open, not closed, you know? And so you're like, okay, yeah, yeah, fingers here. And then like, <laughs> and, like and then you switched it and then you're like, God damn it, why did I move so much? <laughs> How about I just, the best take, just use fucking that. <laughs> it gets so frustrating. Yeah, because and you do it so many times and from all the different angles. And Was it something that you, but you, did you love it enough? I and mean, obviously you loved it enough that you wanted to keep doing it. Oh, I loved it when I was even studying it. I, I loved it. Um, what was it? What, what is it about acting that you really love? I think I liked the, I, I got to feel things. I got to feel everything, anything and everything, good or bad. And I, I don't, not to say like, like I'm an emotional person, but I'm, I'm very, I'm pretty in control of a lot of my emotions in life. And um can be quite even keeled and things um and with acting it's like the i love the up and downs uh of of getting to feel things that you might not get to feel in life and and in, in a safe place to do it where you're not like destroying destroying your life mm -hmm. by uh emotionally losing it um and i think for me acting always was the the my favorite part is when you're when you surprise yourself when you don't know what you're doing so like you're you're in a scene and some the way you respond is you surprise yourself and that being able to like the unpredictability of that and just the things like coming up it's like Woof, where did that come from and right. it's like that and which is kind of you know what i learned to in acting class you're doing scenes like that all the time yeah. and then when you're you're working in t like television it's rare you get to kind of those are very special moments when you get to have scenes like that